When toilet paper flew off the shelves in 2020, desperate shoppers grabbed whatever they could find in stores, including tissue made out of stuff like bamboo. I don't know, it looks pretty soft to me. Um, if someone gave me this, I don't think I would be able to tell the difference. Two years later, it's still selling. Why? Well, bamboo is finally becoming as soft as the real thing, giving players in the space a real boost. Let's do it together. It is tree free. It is made from bamboo. That is Isn't nice. that nice? I might dab This isn't my... normally where I put it, too. We went, you know, from $230,000 revenue in 2017 as like kind of like a startup. And by the end of 2020, we had grown to around two and a half million. Almost overnight, we um, had enough orders. We could have sold out our warehouse kind of several, um, several times over. Toilet paper sold as sustainable isn't new. Recycled bath tissue has been around for decades, but it has fallen short of the softness Americans expect. We want to make sure that our customers don't feel like they're making a sacrifice uh, when they're switching to cloud paper. Enter bamboo. Manufacturers are pitching us on the idea that toilet paper made from trees is bad for the environment, but that's not all. Bamboo has longer fibers, and consumers like that it makes for softer tissue paper than recycled. It's been a long journey for bamboo toilet paper. Some manufacturers have created dozens of versions of the product to make sure it was exactly what consumers wanted. Also, keeping prices competitive with traditional options is key because big brands can easily outspend them on advertising and startups can always lose clients that just switch back to toilet paper made from trees. We're in a commodity market, so there's a lot of price sensitivity and tree-free fiber has historically been quite expensive. Startups are also leaning on emotion and creativity including cheeky commercials. Deep in the downstairs bathroom, Maggie's making the world a better place with her toilet paper. Moreover, many rolls come packaged individually in wrapping that is colorful and artsy, which has led some people to display them openly in their bathrooms and even post pictures of them on social media. Today, these companies make up a tiny sliver of the market, but they're looking to show that the business is viable, which could help prove to bigger brands that making tree-free toilet paper is worth it. Kimberly Clark, which is one of the largest toilet paper makers in the world, launched a bamboo bath tissue in Australia in 2021. I believe that there's tremendous opportunity because forests are finite. We have to find a better solution. Thank you.